Hello everyone, today's tutorial is going to be how to draw a background similar to this as requested on the last video. If you haven't seen my latest videos, the background is more detailed than before 4 years ago or 5 years ago. The background was actually made on Photoshop, not on Flippa Clip, but you can simply use Android applications such as Ibis Paint or Sketchbook. And let's start! So first, you are going to draw a straight line horizontally that represents as a land. And next are the rocks, you just have to draw them vertically. And just like that, uh, draw them in a ri rigid lines, not straight lines, because it's not, the, the land isn't straight, the rock isn't straight, there should be bumps to them, uh, similar to this. So the reason why I draw rocks like this, or why my landscape has these kinds of rocks, is because when they thrown out from a strong punch, at least they have an obstacle to land. Now we have our land and our rocks. The next thing we draw is the clouds. Uh, I'm gonna start with the basic shapes. These are the basic shapes of the clouds. Uh, uh, here's a another way to draw to draw them. Just create uh, circles above, and then draw a straight line below, and just simply erase these circles inside of the uh, thing. I don't know. And there you go. You have a clouds. Now that we are finished with the basic shapes, we are gonna proceed to the complicated process of this artwork which is the coloring and the rendering. So make this basic shape as your guide for your drawing. First I'm going to draw a land or color the land on this picture. Make sure to set your color into blue, a darker blue color. Apply this color to your land and to your rocks. After applying the color on your land, proceed to color the sky as a grayish sky blue. And then grab your airbrush and apply a lighter sky blue color uh, on the top part, not the bottom part. And not so much. For the rocks, Simply apply the same darker blue color, but lower the opacity of them. By the way, these are separate layers. Don't put them on the same layer.
for the clouds color uh, apply a white a plain white just like that Now let's color our land with green. Uh, there's a special brush on Photoshop that has been used by Evanant Designers or Evanant Designs. It's called Evanant Designs, the brush. And this is basically how I apply them. and then apply a mud after that. Same goes to our rocks, just pick a brownish color for the rocks.
and also a green on top but you can skip the green on top depending on you So after applying the colors and the rendering, uh, I play around with the filters to make the image better. I think we are finished. Uh, after that, go to your flip a clip application and add this image, and you're good to go. If this tutorial has been helpful to you, please click the like and subscribe, and also uh, click the notification bell. And if not, then well, f you then. <laughs>